Well, what's going on, Cardinal Nation? Well, man, very uh, disappointing loss tonight. As we come up short, lose 4-3 to the Detroit Tigers. The first of a two-game series against Detroit. Uh, and our, our third loss of four games. All of these losses, though, have been, have been close. Uh, we just, you know, haven't, haven't, uh, gotten clutch moments. You know, we won on Thursday last week and on Sunday, too. Uh, but those were games where we kind of, you know, we're playing small ball quite a bit. And we've kind of scored runs early in games, too. So... Uh, anyway, the Tigers would take a one nothing lead in the top of the second on an RBI single by Derek Hill. Uh, that would put them up one nothing, and then they would go up 2 nothing On a bases loaded walk, driven in by the pitcher, Casey Myers. That's right, the pitcher, Jack Flaherty, would walk the pitcher on four pitches, and, you know, that's not a... That was not a good sign, especially an American League pitcher, a guy who rarely ever gets to bat. And this is a guy that I believe it was actually maybe his first ever at bat in the majors. Uh, this is his first full season. And yes, yeah, so I'll put the Tigers up 2 0. And they would then take a 3 0 lead in the top of the third on a solo home run by Miguel Cabrera. His 14th home run season, and for his career, career home run number 501. As he just hit home run 500 in their previous game against Toronto. And, yeah, so he's climbing, achieving more milestones. He's, uh, like, 40-some hits away from 3,000. And then the next batter, Robbie Grossman. Would go deep his 18th home run, so it would be four to nothing Detroit. And after that home run, Jack Flaherty would be done after not recording it out in the third inning. Uh, and he would leave the game due to shoulder tightness. Uh, and you know that's was not a good sign, uh, especially him coming off the IL. And making two really good starts and you know really hope he doesn't go on the IL again because we need him down the stretch in September so so uh, Daniel Ponce de Leon would then come in and do a pretty nice job between two and a third scoreless innings and Kwon Young Kim is back inserted into the bullpen and he would throw 46 pitches in this game and would walk to a nice work by him. We would get on the board, make it four to one, Tommy Edmund with an RBI ground out. And then Nolan Arenado with an RBI double to score two runs and make it a one run game. Uh, Luis Garcia would get out of trouble in the ninth, but then the bottom of the ninth will go down in order as we come up short, lose 4-3. to three. So, this point, so hopefully we can um, win tomorrow's game. Day game with John Lester getting the start against Tarek Skubal for Detroit, another youngster. He's had a really good year. And, yeah, so, Lester uh, was, had a, Shaky start his last time out, but see how he does in this one. So till Wednesday, uh, 12 o'clock, Alex Barry saying go cards.